It says here at the bottom of my screen that I should say you don't want to miss it, right? Now, usually I read it and go, you don't want to miss it, but, you, I mean, you cannot miss it, right? If, well, you're, you if you're a football fan, we're going to talk about this later on. This is not where we're going now. There are games in the championship tonight, right? There's a lot big. I've written them down the biggest. Leeds take on Sunderland, Leicester Mill, or Mill, Leicester, and Southampton commentary, right? And we'll be asking this question from six. If, if that's one of your teams, right? I just wonder if you're sack off your team to watch one of those. If you've got a, if you've got an important date tonight, and I don't mean a date like with a boyfriend or a girlfriend, but maybe you meant to pick your kid up from swimming. I reckon so many people tonight will be glued to not just the radio, obviously talk sports is where it's at, but the tele. I'm so excited. My team's not even in it. I'm so excited about yeah. tonight's football. There's going to be a lot of kids we either walking home from whatever activities or some wives not getting picked up from the hairdressers. <laughs> <laughs> Who goes to the hairdressers at 8 p.m.? <laughs> Brian, where are you? <laughs> no, it was done. There's going to be, yeah, there's going to be some... Um, some unwanted responses. And a lot me. of lies like, yeah, I can't do it tonight, so the car's broken. Oh, yeah, I can't make it. Can't yeah. do it. I'm so, well. I'm so excited about it. Yeah. Um, I was going to ask you what game you'll be watching, but we've just put out a clip. Rory works, I have to say Rory works at TalkSport, has just put a clip together for yeah. us on Instagram, Andy Goldson 5 What's your Instagram? Uh, Jermaine 7 Pennants. Okay, go check it out. It's very funny. It's homage to Kirby Theater. I'm, yeah. I'm asking you on it, what game you'll be watching, listening to, etc. What one is it? What's your answer to that? Your ex-Arsenal player, what one will you be but watching? I'm going to be watching Real Madrid, I think. Well, I'm going to be watching both. You you have the iPad up on the telly. Yeah, I'm yeah, gonna have Real too. Madrid on the TV. Okay, and then that's the that's the first games that you'll be watching. Real Madrid first, and then and Arsenal. then I'm gonna have the laptop open with Arsenal. Okay, uh, your job has been, and it's possibly the hardest job anyone's ever had to to have or do when they've picked a combined eleven. So you've picked a combined <clears> eleven of all four clubs in action: Real Madrid, Man City, Arsenal, and Bayern Munich. Right? Yes. Even when you start the goalkeepers. I don't know which way you've gone. So you've got it in front of you. I don't know it. I've got it in front of right. me. Right. Out of the four goalkeepers, I'm I'm guessing you're left. Oh. I don't right, I don't even know. So no disrespect to David Raya. Yeah. I don't think he makes the top three. So it's either Courtois, Neuer. This is everyone's fit in this scenario. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or Edison. Yeah. Who have you gone for? I've and gone why? for Courtois. Have you? Yes, I think the, what what he did to the in the Champions League against Liverpool, he was absolutely outstanding. He won them at that game, mm-hmm. and I think he's got the knack of playing in the Champions League final and being in such a monumental figure. Um, we've seen it throughout his career in Real Madrid. So I think you know, putting him in a big game like this, I think that's the kind of goalkeeper you need behind you. Um, so who's better with his feet, him or Edison? Uh, Edison's better with his feet, but. Courtois is not terrible with his feet. He's not terrible. So what's more important? Someone who can shot stop, um, you know, a, a good shot stopper? Yeah. Or someone who's going to be kicking a ball? For me, I'd want someone who's going to be, you know... That's number one on the list, right? On the list, yeah. I agree. I, you know, I agree with that. I'd rather have a great, great goalkeeper who's yeah. a shot stopper than someone that can distribute. Yeah. I know I football's say, not like that anymore, and it is all about distribution but, from the back. But Courtois can distribute as well. It's not terrible. Yeah. So... You know, the, the pros and cons way out as a shot stopper. So that's why I've gone with okay. him. Back four, this would be so interesting. Everyone's fit, so you can, if you want, pick Kyle Walker. But who have you gone for? I, I think right back, it's Kyle Walker. Okay. I think, you know, that pace. I think as a full back, if you've got pace, that's half the battle won against your your opponent. Yeah. So I've gone Walker is reliable, right back. Centre backs. <laughs> Good. I mean, I don't know how you've done this, but go on. <laughs> Centre backs is. I've gone with Saliba. If I look at all the defenders wow, okay. that each team have gone, I've gone Saliba and I've gone Stones. Have you really? Yeah. I think Stones is a better defender than Gabriel. Okay. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Wow, from the gallery. Wow. I think Stones is a better defender than Gabriel. I think. Be- or, a better def- or a better player. Be- better player, but also I know, defender I don't as well. I know if he's a better defender. Better player than because <laughs> <laughs> no, he I, plays I, that role where he, he goes into midfield yeah, and I, and I, I don't I, know if Saliba plays that but I don't know it's giving me a headache now thinking about it yeah I, I know I know, Saliba, I, I know I Saliba. Saliba. I don't think I'll do that no I'm having Saliba I know I'm having Stones I think I'm, oh, having, right. I'm having Stones over Gabriel okay. I think they're the best probably peering in that okay you need you need some kind of ball playing mid uh, defender there that can pop into midfield and, and Stones is the one and this is why okay. I want Stones because you it will come to it in a minute and then on the left back I've got Alfonso Davis. Okay. Absolute speed. Another speed merchant on the other side. So, yeah. you know, if we are in a bit of trouble, the pace I was getting back out of it. 
Okay, you could. Who's who's left back from Madrid? Is it Mendy? Is it him? You didn't. Yeah. You haven't put him in. No, I think Davies is a, a better. Okay. Fit. I mean, yeah, I mean, they're all going to be amazing. They're all right? going to be amazing. By right? the way, while we're going through this, if you disagree with Eddie. Oh three seven one seven double two double three double four. Midfield, good luck. Yeah, this is where I, it's, it could be a bit controversial, and, and there's oh, going to be. A can lot I guess of, one? Yeah, go. I would, I would imagine Rodri is hundred percent in your midfield. He's the, he's the sitting. Yeah. Okay, he's my DM. Okay, I've gone with, with Rodri. We you know. Um, yeah. And then I've, <laughs> gone, <laughs> and then I've gone for Bellingham eight. I know number ten. That's his role. That's his spot. But. I want him at number eight. I want no, that's him... fair. I mean, Real Madrid play him as their sort of false nine, right? He's, yeah. There's no one in front of him at yeah, Madrid. Yeah, so I'm going Bellingham there. Um, oh, no, Kevin De Bruyne at Bellingham. Oh, wow. Yeah. And then I'm going my number 10 spot in front of then Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, sorry. That's what I meant, yeah. yeah. Kevin De Bruyne, Bellingham and Rodri. Yeah. I mean, that that can't be bettered, can it? It can be bettered. It can be bettered. Same I who you think well, you'd change. Please. I've got the producers there. They're saying... saying Oh, it's too too complicated. What my producer's alluding to the fact is that how are you going to put Haaland and Kane in that? Well, he, he thinks is, Kane should be the well, ten. Well, there we go. No, no, right. no. Well, can I give advice to my producer? Yep. Yeah. Change your profession. Become a footballer. <laughs> become an ex-footballer. You can be alongside me. Right. Right. So then we're going to move Hold on. So my... it's Rodri, De Bruyne, Bellingham. Yeah. Or or Rodri, Bellingham, De Bruyne. Yeah, They're yeah, all yeah. interchangeable. I know. Anyway. I, I see yeah, what you're yeah, saying. Yeah. We'll yeah. keep it. We'll keep it fluid. And then. By the way, there's an Arsenal fan in there. If you don't say Saka, he might come in there and beat you up. Who you yeah, it's going to be a few. Right, so I'm going to, I'm going to leave that last. Hold so, on, hold on. Have you only got, you've only got one down the middle. Yeah? You've yeah, e- yeah. You've only either got Kane or Haaland, right? Correct. Okay. Who have you got on the left? On the left, I've got Vini Jr. There's no Phil Foden in this team. No. Okay, Vinicius Jr. Okay, yeah. Vinicius Jr. on the left. Okay. You, you, it's so uh, ridiculous. Uh, how, this can, is. how can you argue <laughs> that? <laughs> so, okay. Yeah, so I've got Vinicius Jr. On, on the left. On the right, this is subjective. The producer is looking at me. He's looking at me. Is that shaking? You haven't put Zachary in, have you? I've gone Rod- Rodrigo. Okay. <laughs> Look at that <them> face. <laughs> it's carnage. Yeah. Rodrigo, yeah. I think he offers just a little <laughs> bit more. He's been there. He's been Champions League. He's yep. won Champions League. He knows what it's like. And big games, he steps up. So I'm going Rodrigo. And now, and- this is it. If we had a drum roll, I'd say, drum roll, you've either gone Haaland or Kane. Yeah. I think you would have gone, I think you would have gone, because of longevity, Kane is what I think. Because if there was a game of football tomorrow, oh, I don't even know. I can't even finish that sentence. Um, there was a World Cup final tomorrow. I only pick one up top for me, Haaland or Kane. Who am I picking? I think I'm picking Kane. I think uh, I'm picking Kane. Do you want the drum roll? The... Yeah. Who have you gone for? Harry Kane. Okay. Tell me why. Right, the reason I've gone for Harry Kane is that, yes, Haaland is a fantastic goal scorer, but so is Harry Kane. You've seen his numbers now, buying me yeah. what he's doing. Yeah. But if we look at Hull as a player, Harry Kane is a better player yeah. than Haaland. He holds the ball up better. Mm-hmm. He drops deep. He can assist better. He, he brings in players better. Around the box, inside the box, Haaland's fantastic. But as a player, Harry Kane will give you more. Let me, let me play devil's advocate. I agree with everything you've said. If you've got a midfield of Kevin De Bruyne, Rodri, and who's the other one you said? Jude Bellingham. Bellingham. Do you need a player to drop deep? You don't, but sometimes you will come against teams where it's difficult and you need someone to also add okay. a bit a bit more. Okay. We've seen Ireland against uh, Arsenal. When it's hard and difficult, yeah, he, he, he vanishes. Yeah. <laughs> you know, okay, no, I agree with So that. someone like Kane, he can unlock that pass and an extra player that can do that. Okay. So it just gives you more vers- versatility. Let, let me look at the gallery. Would we all go Kane over Haaland? They'll, oh, they'll say, yeah, okay. Well done, you got that one right. Please, Caligula says yes. Um, go over your team one more time, and then we'll put it out for people to find out and go. What are you talking about, Jermaine Pennant? <laughs> Timo Corti in goal. Uh, uh, Alfonso Davis left back. Saliba Stones pairing. Kyle Walker right back. Rodri Bellingham and De Bruyne are all in the middle. Vinicius Junior, Harry Kane, and Rodrigo on the right. Okay. The, the midfield, no one can argue with that. I think that's the best. Someone's midfield, saying Declan Rice, but where does he go? Oh, you forgot Declan Rice. But where's he? he's not better than Rodri. We need twelve but, and thirteen. But Declan Rice and Rodri are the same kind of player. And, and, Rodri, and Rodri is a little bit better. Correct. Uh, and we love Declan Rice. We do love him. We do love him. But, right. that's, but that's, Rodri, yeah. Okay. Good luck with this. Oh three seven one seven double two double three to four. We do. Be that. We do. There's your challenge. <laughs> 
TalkSport Drive with Andy Goldstein. Monday to Friday afternoon from 4 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.